All right, so here's little buddy that I found in the uh, five-gallon bucket about to drown. He was just barely keeping his head up, and I think it's the same one that uh, that uh, I found the other day that was in the chicken coop that I put in a tree in the front, and he seemed to have found his way back, and now he was doused in the five-gallon bucket of water. I dried him off, gave him some goat milk and some diced up um, apples and a little bit of my dog's um, raw food. And so he ate it all up, but um, he's quite the, the toothy one. But I think that's just a deterrent because anybody that sees that mouth is not going to mess with him very much. Anyway, I'm going to give the poor being a life chance, fatten him up, get him a little bit bigger so he can be out on his own and survive. And then I'm going to take him to some woods far away from here and say, be on your own, my friend. So another day of letting nature do its thing.